Slayer. I'm glad to see you again. The pelt from Callisto the Bear. I wish I'd had the chance to see this creature in the wild. It must have been stunning. It was. But there are other things on this earth far more beautiful. And wild? If not, then where would the challenge be in pursuing it? Eagle bearer, my name is Herodianos, second to Taletas in battle. The dogs of war howl for blood, and thanks to you, Sparta now howls back. Sounds like a lot of howling. Fight with us! Together we'll run our shields through their skulls and spears through their hearts! I'd be honored to fight with Sparta. To battle! We can't move! The people are happy. As they should be! For the first time since Ares cursed us with war, the Delos Islands know freedom! But where's Kira? It's not like her to miss a chance to drink with her troops. She told me you kept her secret. I'm still shocked. Movarkis was a complicated man, but he was still her father. She snuck off to send him to the ferryman alone. All good warriors deserve their send-off, I suppose. Even Bodarkis. Pray that we're shown the same kindness when our time comes. 
the meantime, there is wine to be drunk and tales to be told. <laughs> Make the tale great. The troops deserve it. Even Thaletas. Certainly, if you can find him. And when you do, remind him, I still plan to tell him how I lost this eye. And the crew? Ready to sail? On your order. But first, let the crew enjoy a drink and a song. You deserve one too. Go now, into the river of black night, and embrace the boundless gloom. You shall wander, obscure, even in the house of Hades, flitting among the sad of death. I shouldn't have to say goodbye alone. I'm glad I'm not alone. I've wanted to watch him burn for so long. Now that it's happened, I thought I'd feel peace. And what do you feel? I used to feel vengeful. Now, empty. He's gone, but you're still here. The people need you. If you don't protect them, there will be another Podarkis to come and take his place. You're right. They do need me. And I need them. We're rebels with nothing left to rebel against. They need me now more than ever. Thank you. What will you do next? Mykonos will need to rebuild. Then that's what we'll do. But not to put it back as it was, not as Father wanted. We'll make this place a new home for our people to be free. To live good lives. Kira... He's gone. Your rebels are waiting. They're celebrating. <sighs> Let's celebrate. Goodbye, Father. Thaletas? What are you doing out here? Thinking. Praying. This was my time, Cassandra! What? This glory was supposed to be mine. But you took everything from me! You took Podarkis. You took these islands. You took Kira, my love! No one belongs to you, Thaletas. I didn't take your glory. I helped you. You did nothing! We were in love, you know. We can't be again. I can still have her heart. Still prove to her I'm the warrior she wants. For the gods! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. 
Thanks for being with me back there. I needed you. I wanted to be. You know that. Oh, did you hear? They're promoting Thaleta to general and sending him back to Sparta in the morning. Thaletas is dead. He attacked me on the beach because of us. He what? No! Why would he? Taletas! You fool! You stubborn, bullheaded, glorious fool! And you just had to kill him, didn't you? He left me no choice. I sent out two notes. And who responds? Taletas the Spartan and Cassandra the Eagle Bearer. I never imagined you'd both bring me so much sorrow. Kira, I'm sorry. So am I, Mistios. So am I. You look ready to go. Odarkis is gone, Kira's with her rebels, and I have other targets to hit. Then we sail! But first, I may have told Kira you'd give a speech to the rebels before saying goodbye. Let's say goodbye. Sheridan! Settle down! Settle down! Cassandra has something she'd like to say. Dillians! Today, you have your freedom! So celebrate! Let Dionysos fill your cup and the muses sing your song! And now, a toast to Cassandra! To victory! A fine speech, though I'm not sure many of these rebels can imagine a free Venus. I think they liked it. Of course, of course! Who wouldn't? I'll round up the crew. See you back at the ship? Socrates! The rebels are hunting Athenians. What are you doing here? I came to teach, as I always do, but don't worry. I sail on a merchant ship set for Attica in the morning. Wise as always. Thanks for coming to see us off. Speaking of being off, Varnavas, are we ready to sail? The crew are in fine spirits, if a little hungover. But the ship is ready. Good. I only wish we weren't leaving Kira alone to rebuild her home. Are any of us truly alone who have our friends and allies beside us? Exactly! Do you remember what you told me when you first set foot on these sands? I said we were here to kill Podarkis. That's what we set out to do, and that's precisely what you did! They don't call you the mighty Mystios for nothing! <laughs> who calls me that? He does. Now then! It's time we give the crew some orders. Where do we sail to next? Podarkis was only one cultist, Varnavas. Wherever we sail, we will find more of them. And I will kill them all.
more on arrows. Gotta be careful. Careful. Don't oh. be caught here. Take no prisoners! Oh, no, no! Birthplace of Apollo himself. <laughs> Impressive. I will thank you, Mystios. They were going to kill me, but you killed them first. There will be more. Hurry, follow me. I saw you. You loved spilling blood on sacred soil, just like me. I'm nothing like you. Now shut up and follow me before you get us killed. Death to our oppressors! And anyone else who tries to claim the Delos Islands! Delians are free! More Delians will die if you don't shut up. S you have a very loud mouth. You could have gotten us both killed. Then our sacrifice would set fire to the hearts of the rebels! Then cast every non-Delian into the sea for Poseidon to chew up and spit out! You realize I'm not Delian. The Spartans who fought and died for the rebellion are also not Delian. Athenians want these islands for our wealth. The Spartans want these islands for Sparta. I won't let them have it. We don't need them. We don't want them. Delians should rule Delos alone. Now, if you don't mind, I'm going straight to Kira. The rebels must leave their caves. The time to attack is now. I can't let you go back to Mykonos alone. I knew it. You're one of them. You don't belong here. I'll send you and your kind to the sticks. <laughs> That's not right. I wonder what they've got. Σοφόκλης, Σοφόκλης, Άγιε και Φέρε, Πλειάδα χορευτών και Παράστηκη Ενημή Μετασμάτων. Α, Κασάνδρα, seeing you on Thelos sets my heart at ease. So tell me, how was your encounter with the rebellious prisoner? You never told me he was an extremist lunatic. Ah, but who am I to judge? What is too much or too crazy? Are we not both at some point or another? He would have thrown you and your philosophies into the sea. <laughs> Perhaps when I was thinner, both in weight and philosophy. So, tell me, were you able to resolve the situation without bloodshed? The rebel had guards. I relieved them. Hmm, interesting. You thought the life of a thief and a murderer was worth more than that of soldiers doing their duty. I wasn't even thinking about him, to be honest. And what of the rebel? He's dead. Probably for the best. Hmm, best for Thelos, best for the rebellion, or best for you? Yes. Ah, 
Our choices are like ripples on water. They seem tiny and insignificant at the beginning, but they can become devastating tidal waves by the time they run their course. It's a pleasure, Socrates. I can always count on you to give me a devastating headache. <laughs> the pleasure is mine, Cassandra. Hope to see you around the symposiums again. Don't hold your breath. You're bleeding. A lot. Come to turn me into the priests? Depends what you've done. Don't know if anyone told you, but it's illegal to die on this godforsaken island. So I've been told. Shame nobody told the beast roaming around. Vrach me to the one who kills it. If you're paying, I'll hunt and kill this beast for you. You're not the first hunter to tell me that. But I still have all my Vrachmi. I've hunted many beasts. What am I hunting this time? I'd call it a bear, but I'd be lying. This creature is Artemis's nightmare. Where's the beast now? Got as far away from that thing as I could. You'll find it north of here, near the coast. Just follow the trail of bodies. The bloodier the mess, the closer you are. You're not from around here, are you? Came through Arcadia. But Corinthia is my home. I'll find the beast and kill it. Try not to bleed out before I return.
were a mighty beast, but you did not belong here. You're alive! And the monster? The bear's dead, and you owe me payment. But first, let's talk about you. Arcadia, right? Yes. The bear was being smuggled from Arcadia. I found a record of what was on your ship, and your bloody handprints. Talk! All right, all right! We were smuggling the bear for a man named Sargon. Poseidon had other ideas. One of his storms crashed us here, and that evil beast broke free. It went right for the crew. That explains the bodies. They were my family! You've suffered enough. What the villains don't know won't kill them. A mystios with a heart. You're as rare as that monster. Here, take what Rachmi I have left. Kere. And don't let the villains catch you bleeding everywhere. Let's go. You've come to face me. That was a mistake. Yeah. <sighs> 
here we are. Oh, this must be the place the old man spoke of. There it is. The flower. The flowers. I should hurry back to the old man near Gortin. Hades claims another. In all my life, I've never seen him so peaceful. I hope he's found matter. Those flowers, are they...? Yes. He asked me to fetch them. <laughs> you silly old man. Is this why you left Pefka? To fetch matter flowers so far from home? <laughs> you silly, stubborn old man. Here. Thank you so much, Miss Dios. He made a promise to his wife, and I made a promise to him. I don't have anything to offer you. Mater must be so glad you brought her flowers. He never did when she was alive. Before those vultures pack my eyes out, not to mention the wolves. I saw them in the bushes earlier. You called me Mystios. You must know my help comes at a price. You don't look like you're in much of a position to pay. W why it? Hear me out. The people who did this to me, they took everything I had and left me for dead. They've got plenty of other treasures and trinkets at their hideouts too. Free me and I'll tell you where to find them. Quick, Mistios, untie me. <sighs> My luckiest wolves. <laughs> 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 I'll make offerings thanking the gods for you. You're alive and free. Now, tell me about my reward. Those Malakis took my only prized possession. A family heirloom. An amulet handed down from my mother. They keep their spoils underwater in a cave just west of here.
Which one of the thugs took your amulet? The leader, a burly man with a huge axe, wears it now. Take his head, and the amulet is yours to keep. Who left you like this? The followers of Ares. I joined them thinking I could get rich quick. But the sacrifices and murders, Mystios, it's terrible. I tried to sneak away with some of their stuff. And got caught. You've got to kill them all, Mystios. They're crazy. You deserted the followers of Ares and expect to live? What's your plan? I assumed I'd become Carrion. But wait. Maybe... I don't like the sound of this. How... how about I work for you? I know how to fight. The followers of Ares gave me that much, at least. What do you say? Okay, you work for me now. I don't see much value in you, but it's better than nothing. I'll see you back at your ship then, Commander. Not before putting on some clothes. What was that all about? The military suspects me of smuggling deserters from the war front. Okay, fine. They knew I was doing it. Mm-hmm. Ugh! My luck is guards! They hit like bricks! Did you see a man on your way here? A skinny sort of idiot, wearing army colors. I found a body near a cliff in the gulch. He had a note on him. No, 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 he can't be dead. We had the perfect plan to get him home to his wife. I promised her I wouldn't let him end up like the other deserters. You must be close to him to risk your life to help. Or he was paying you a lot. I... I did it for the girl. Girl? What girl? His wife? There's always a girl, isn't there? Look, he got drafted into the war. She wouldn't stop crying. And my speciality is making people disappear. In a different way than you do. So... I decided to help them get back together. You just want her for yourself. That's not it. I mean, I have thought about it, but... Look, I just... I just... Uh, want to see her smile. All right? I'm sure you do. Uh... We need to get to Isabel. I mean, the wife. If the guards come after me, she'll be in danger too. Please... Go to her. I'll catch up when I can take her to safety. I'll make sure she's safe. Where will I find her? Follow the road to Kidonia. Her house will be on the left. Look for the green cloth on the doorpost. Quickly. I'll catch up as soon as I can. Here. go with you I told you to be something happened to your shipment huh did something happen to your shipment yes idiots happened they dropped it and shattered my obsidian glass you were carrying it too did you say something whelp I said curse those clumsy fools exactly now I need more obsidian if you can bring me some Mistios, my finest blade shall be yours do we have a deal I'll get you your... What? Is that a yes? Did she say... She sure did, boss! Idiot! Wonderful! My apprentice here will tell you where to find the obsidian. Thanks for doing this, else he wouldn't have sat up. There are stashes of the stuff in the Temple of Britomartis and the sunken ruins. If you have any questions, point them at me. I've had enough of his booming voice for one day. I've got all I need. I'll be back with the obsidian glass. She's going to get your stuff now! Wonderful! Return quickly, Mistios. Please hurry. My ears can't take any more of his complaining. <clears throat> Here's your obsidian glass. Excellently done, Mistios. She got the stuff! 
Oh, well done, Mistios. Take my blade. May it serve you well. Now he'll finally shut up for a bit. I heard that. I'm glad to see you again. I'll return when I... again. The bull put up quite a fight, but his pelt is yours. You are remarkable. Years of training made me a warrior. Life as a Mystios has honed those abilities. Then, at the least, you should applaud yourself for your dedication to your art. I'll return when I have more pelts. I have your Malaikas tokens. No more games, no more schemes to rob me of my Drachmi. It's time to slay a Minotaur! Absolutely, Mistios. Uh, no problem. But first, perhaps you'd like to buy back your exquisite, uh, finely crafted trial tokens? This offer will expire in... Uh... By the gods! They uh, make for fantastic gifts. Not... Another Drachmi. Oh, but Champion, surely you want something to help you remember the Befka pre-trial? I... sorry, 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 sorry. And all that's left is facing our star attraction himself, the Minotaur! Are you ready to meet your doom? If your pre-trials are anything to go by, yes, yes I am. Well, good! Great! I... I... I want you to fight the Minotaur! You'll find the beast in the depths of the Cave of the Brave. On the Zithki Plateau. Two other warriors have just completed their pre-trials. You can speak to them for more information. They'll join you when you're ready to, you know, die horrifically. You've come all this way. Join us. <laughs> no, 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 no. I have a very important uh, pottery lesson to attend. So... <clears throat> And...
And you must be... the warriors. Look, brother! The final member of our Minotaur hunting party has arrived! When the beast sees our assembled might, he will moo miserably in fear! Do Minotaurs moo, or...? If it's all right with both of you, I'd like to strike the killing blow. Or can we at least say I struck the killing blow? I'm willing to haggle down to play the key role in distracting the Minotaur while allowing the killing blow to be struck. The Minotaur is a mythical creature. Only someone just as mythical could slay it. You're talking about me, right? The only myths about you, little brother, are the ones Butter paid to keep quiet. <sighs> this can only end well. Are you ready to ride? Not yet. I need more time. <laughs>